All right, we're leaving the store. Let's, uh, let's take a little walk. A lot of people uh, say they want to, you know, see me take more walks and see what's going on around the shop and stuff, you know. So, let's take a quick walk. Let's see what we got. Behind us is the Flatiron Building, down that way. This way is the Empire State Building. Way up there. There it is. Uh, let's take a little walky walk. Let's see what's around here. Where can we go? So, taking a little walk, having a little chat with my viewers. Hi guys. How you doing? Hi, hi Secret Daisy. Hello Dave. Bearded Vato. You Vato Sucio, how you doing? Um, hello Scott Raymond, how are you sir? Hi there. Steve from England. Steve. How's the missus? How's the better hat? Try chrome. Hope everybody is well. Honestly, I'm supposed to be in the shop right now, but I'm just taking a walk or what the heck kind of thing. It's just like one of those things. No reason at all. This is Koreatown, basically, where I'm walking right now. Everything is pretty much 100% Korean owned here. Um, behind me is the BCD Tofu House. They make their own tofu. Barbecue and set up. Pretty trendy, expensive area. There's a lot of food courts and stuff. I'm gonna go into this uh, Korean food court and take you in there now. It's pretty interesting. They're selling these taiyaki in the front. What are these? We've got the, uh, the hot dogs and the stick. And it's a big trend now. Korean street food. Fried hot dogs with uh, french fries on the outside. And cheese and stuff. Let's check out the taiyaki. They have fried uh, snapper fish with Nutella and stuff inside it. Those, yeah, those are nice. The Nutella croissant taiyakis. Some of them have uh, green tea, some have custard, some have Nutella. Korean school food. Tayaki's the best though. These little uh, fish that they're uh, fish shaped cakes that they're making with like hot dough inside and uh, Nutella piping hot. They're really, really good. That's what she's cooking in there. Those are the Tayaki's and stuff. And those little presses. Cooking some uh, buns here, steamed Chinese buns. walk more. Maybe let's walk to the fruit guy, see if he's got pomegranates for me. I don't know about you guys, but I'm a pomegranate man. 
I used to be scared of them actually. You know, I didn't know how to eat them and what's the deal with the seeds. The weird thing about pomegranates is like when you start eating them, after a while, you know, they start tasting so good, you start forgetting about the seeds. They're kind of like not even there anymore. And it's just juicy, it's weird. And then if you think about it, you're aware of it, then you take the seeds are there. You, everyone is, well, it's like a little bit crunchy, but they're actually amazing. Uh, pomegranates are a weird fruit. They're hard to sort of pick. You don't know what they look like inside. They could be really like amazing ruby red little gems. Or they could be these little rotten things, like rotten brown little things on the side. Or they could be mostly little gems, a couple little rotten ones on the side. I'm a, I'm a pomegranate guy. In the last two days, my friend here has not had them. It's all right. I've got about three or four pomegranate sources. So we're good, we're good. It's one of the expensive parking lots here. Oh, half an hour special, 10 bucks. All right, not terrible. One hour is $30. Two hours is 36. 10 hours, 43. All right, pretty typical New York. This is a really, really trendy uh, tea place, Korean tea place. People like to take pictures of their fancy teas for Instagram and stuff. They're super expensive. Six, seven, eight bucks. About Starbucks prices, not that bad. Taro, boba, pudding, milk, and cream mousse. They lay on lay it on thick here. Brown sugar, taro, pudding, cream mousse. Sorry. Cool tiger. All right, let's see if this uh, pomegranate guy is here. Oh, this is always really cool. There's a Nathan's right here. So whenever I want Nathan's, it's like right on the corner by JJ's. Nathan's fries, Nathan's hot dogs. I'm vegetarian, but I do like their fries, though. I eat them like crazy. Onion rings probably aren't bad either. COVID lab. Another COVID lab. COVID's everywhere. It's getting bad again, guys. Oh, let's see what the deal is. Pomegranate. What is the story with pomegranate today? So, so, we oh, got some, too. Pomegranate is so hard to choose. Two dollars. Yeah, two, right? One, two. Thank you, my friend. I've got the pomegranates, right? Sorry, I had my dollar bill covering up the uh, lens there. Uh, how should we get back to the store? Let's go a different way. What else is interesting that I could show you? This way? Let's go the other way. Yeah, so uh, now that we're taking a little walk and we're getting acquainted to uh, guys, uh, let's have a little chat. So um, I'll tell you what's been going on with the channel, with Hats and Guitars, um, lately. I don't know if you've noticed, but I've been putting out a lot, lot more content. I've been trying to get at least like one a day, uh, sometimes two a day. And I've been putting out uh, 
on average about 43, 45% more content than usual. It's been going on now for about uh, a month, maybe two months, uh, uh, but a lot stronger this month. But uh, what I'm trying to do now is build up the channel a little bit so that uh, it could be a potential source of income for me at some point. Um, so that I could maybe spend a little bit more time uh, with the family at home, work from home. Another thing uh, I'm trying to uh, plan is a hat consultation kind of a thing where uh, people can pay like a tiny fee to actually, uh, you know, talk to me and uh, we could uh, work out, you know, what you need to buy and what looks good on you and stuff. Uh, and uh, we're working that out. The other thing is uh, we're working out a, uh, a Kevin Fix Your Hat service kind of thing where you might be able to mail your hat to me. And uh, again, for a pretty small fee and shipping, I'd be able to just fix up your hat, stretch it, do whatever I need, and then just mail it right back to your door. So these uh, have not been implemented. They're not in uh, motion yet in service, but uh, I'm kicking these ideas around now and trying to work things out so that it may be uh, doable you know, try to work it out with the boss and everything and uh, shipping and shipping materials. So at the moment, uh, we're not doing it. Um, but these are some of the plans that I've got. Um, I've been trying to increase the musician and guitar side of the channel too. Um, I'm not only going to be doing like commercials for guitar pedals and stuff. Uh, I'm going to uh, be doing a lot more uh, guitar stuff, like some guitar lessons and uh, showing you, you know, what I do with my equipment and uh, some basic music things. We might even do something like my top 20 favorite artists of all time. And maybe I could play a few of their songs for you too. Um, and um, so that's about it. I'm definitely putting out a lot more hat content uh, and I'm taking suggestions. One guy says I should try on the hats more. Um, I should do more flat caps and newsboards. So keep the suggestions coming because I'm responsive to it. And, um, that's about it, guys. Uh, gotta get back to work, help these uh, losers out. I know they miss me. So uh, it's getting dark here in Koreatown. And uh, lots of love uh, from me to you. Um, oh God, I hate saying this, but um, hit like if you like my video. And uh, hit the subscribe button down there too if you can. It'll just help my my station, my channel here get more popular. Help me actually make some money, hopefully at some point uh, in the game, and uh, you know help it to survive for longer, so I could do more of this content and less of the you know work and work and taking the subway and stuff like that. So spend a little bit more time with you guys. So um, let's hope that goes well, guys. It's getting a little too dark now, so I'm gonna get back to the store. Okay, take care. That's what I'm here for. <laughs> <laughs> oh and now folks it's time to say good night we sincerely appreciate your patronage and hope we've succeeded in bringing you an enjoyable evening of entertainment please drive home carefully and come back again soon good night <laughs>